Arena Sabalenka versus Chen Wen Zhang is the final of Wuhan 2024. Both players have been very impressive to get to this stage. Zhang entered the tournament as the number five seed, and we get a buy in the first round. In the second round, she take on the wild card Christian, but this was no problem getting through in straights. 6 2 6 4. In the third round, she take on Fernandez, and after dropping the first set, would fight back to win. 5 7 6 3 6 Love. In the quarterfinals, she take on Paolini, the number three seed. We had a very impressive 2024, and this was a battle. After splitting the first two sets, Zhang would fight back to win. 6 2 3 6 6 3 to advance to the semi final. In the semi final, she take on Wong, who had beaten Pagula and Alex. And drove her along the way. There's no problem for Jung getting through in straights. 6 3 6 4 to advance to the final. Sabalenka into the tournament as the number one seed. We're going to buy in the first round. In the second round, she take on Sinia Kova. And after a couple of close sets, would get through in straights. 6 4 6 4. In the third round, she take on Putin Seva, who just beaten Vekic in the previous round. And after dropping the first set, Sabalenka would fight back to win. 1 6 6 4 6 Love. In the quarterfinal, she take on Fret, who had taken out Navarro and Adaj Meyer along the way. There's no problem for Sabalenka getting through in straights. 6 2 6 2 to advance to the semi finals. In the semi finals, Sabalenka would take on the number four seed. Goff, who she's had some real battles against in the past. And after dropping the first set and being a breakdown in the second, Sabalenka would fight back to win. 1 6 6 4 6 4 to advance to the final. These two have played three times before, with Sabalenka winning all three times in straight sets, including two times this year, one at the Australian Open final, and of course one at the US Open. So it's been really tough for Zhang mentally to play against Sabalenka. Being at home maybe might give her a bit more comfort. And also the way that Sabalenka played against Goff might help Zhang a little bit as well in this matchup. If Zhang's gonna win this one, she needs to serve well and also try not to be intimidated by Sabalenka. Also using the crowd to her advantage. Maybe being at home might help her a little bit with the crowd being 99% on her side. Maybe that'll give her the comfort and also the confidence to finally beat Sabalenka. If Sabalenka's going to win this one, she needs to limit the errors because she wasn't playing great against Goff. She got a little bit lucky because Goff double-folded so many times. Zhang's not, probably not going to do that in her match in this final. So Sabalenka's going to be much, much better and much more cleaner than she was in that semi-final. She's going to beat Zhang and win another Wuhan title. Very interesting match. I feel like this is going to be the best one they've played. I know the last three matches they've played have all been one-sided, but I'm still going to go with Sabalenka in three sets. I reckon Zhang might win her first set against Sabalenka because it is at home. It is in China for, for Zhang, but I'm going to go with Sabalenka in three sets to lift the Wuhan trophy, but I'm going to do that in the comments below. Who you got winning the title?